Hello everyone and welcome to the Gaming by Geeks channel. My name is Adam and once again I'm back with more Minecraft All the Mods 8. Uh, let's get an axe. Now I don't want to have plain oak wood ceiling and floor. And that is the reason why I decided to, to have a few different trees out here. So we've got palm, so let's chop down a couple of these. So we've got we've got these absolutely massive canopy tree logs that actually broke my axe. Obviously, we've got these cascading archwood logs as well. So let's go back in. Jeez, look at this lot! All came pretty much all came from from the trees, apart from the. Uh, the stone. So these berries, nightshade, go away before I accidentally eat you and kill myself, or something along those lines. Is there space for these two? Three. There is. So what's going to be the nicest logs for my floor here? So I've taken two, two here. What do we th what do we think? Let, you know, let's make some some space, and I'll put down three of each, and we'll see which one looks the nicest. Now, do I want a dark one or do I want it light and nice in here? Should I go for palm because canopies are a little bit dark, aren't they? Yeah, let's go palm. It's a bit lighter. I know it's very close to um, to the oak on the roof, but I, I would prefer things to be lighter. Yeah, definitely. Uh, now what I can do, because we're doing ridiculous volumes, let's up the range and just see how much we can get done in in one single click, which is very large amounts. I've just run out, look. It was so so much. Uh, so let's get myself yet another axe. I mean I'm not too sure why I'm being picky about which axe I I take. It's just me being weird. In fact, these are the only axes I've got now. So let's have a Minotaur axe. So that counts as a, a tree axe. Uh, oh, I don't have any palm trees left. So I'm going to have to plant some and just make do with the wobbly, horrible floors. Hi Enderman. What are you doing here? Actually there was nothing wrong with him there. I was just being... I was just being mean. Roots there, is that amount to anything? No, you just break them and they go away. So while we wait for that lot to to, to grow, let's sort my bag out. Put away all of the garbage I don't need which is a fair portion of things. Put my exchanging gadget back. And marvel at the wonders of the new house. We're not quite there yet though because I want to keep things a little bit more a little bit more airy. Uh, so I want a bunch of glass 
and I'm going to have some some holes up here, some some you know roof windows and maybe some side windows like this one. I've only got the one here. It'd be nice if I could could actually see outsides. <laughs> now that downstairs, the uh, the the thing with the stuff, the thing I can't remember the name of. Redstone furnace is a little slow, so should we have a look at, at what augments they can can have? Now this this is all changed, so I I need to to understand how this works now. But uh, it looks like thermal series. Here it is. RF capacity. This is oh, that's for batteries. Expanded tanks, item filler, increases process speed but reduces RF efficiency. Okay, so that I think is the one that we want. Let's see. So you can do speed, you can do efficiency. Uh, what else can you do? Increases the non primary output, so increase secondary output. We've got products maybe transferred to input on process. Interesting. Uh, increases generation rates, increases fuel efficiency. So I think pretty much this one here is the the one that needs to go in there to to make things faster. And it needs lead gears, it needs electrum plates and a redstone flux coil. I don't have Electrum right now, so I'm not going to worry too much about it. It's not hard to get or anything, it's just... It's a long, it's a long make. <laughs> for, for very little gain. So let's just put some windows. Let's just have a little bit of... bit of light coming in. There's no reason why I can't have you know some sort of skylight um, sort of windows up here. Well, <laughs> I had one use left on it. Wow. What's this one? Attacks of a 35% also hit other people nearby. It's an axe. I shouldn't be using it as a weapon. See, look how light and airy that's going to be now. Nice. You don't want, to, don't want. I don't want a window there. That's a poor, a poor choice for a window. Do I want a window by the bed? That's not such a bad option. I can even put one there. Look. See, look how light and airy it is now. Much, much nicer. You know, who, who wouldn't want to have a window a, a, you know, in a kitchen, even though it is at ground level, which is kind of weird. So I think, yeah, there we go. I, mean, I, I don't have to do much. I'm not going to spend a lot of time over there. Uh, do I have any? I do have palm logs. I have palm logs, look. Not just planks. I have plenty of palm logs now. So let's get my exchange back. Let's put you all the way down to one because I've got these edges here to do. Love the graphics, by the way. I love the way that it does the, the exchange. Looks looks pretty cool. Sure, what is a hole there? Let's put this back to three. Seems I'm a bit, a bit more open here now. Do you know what? Can I put it to five and do the whole lot in one go without it going over? Not bad. 
not bad. Hey, there we go. Slightly boring, but bigger, lighter, in my opinion, a little bit nicer. So, I think that is a job well done. So, next up is try and automate some of this a little more. So I'm going to keep running in and and you know, doing this, grabbing all of the all of the stuff that is being made. Um, I think it's fair to say I don't need any more cactus. So I think I can put Inferium back back in. How have I just got another How did I just get that? Have I missed something here? Inferium farmland? Or was that just a... No, I don't know. <laughs> soldier, Solium Dagger. Gets me some soldiers. Okay, I can make one of them later. Tinkering table is used to upgrade essence gear with augments. Now, essence gear, I haven't even bothered looking at. I'm not sure exactly how good it is. Uh, that was actually pretty good. Might, I might have to look into that at some point, especially if I'm about to automate the production of this a little more. Um, what do I have? Is it just all netherite? I oh, netherite and Ethereum, that's fine. Let's take you. Let's take you. Let's take you. Let's take all of you. Let's get back inside my awesome, huge, airy house that is on fire. Uh. What the hell happened? What happened there? What? What? <laughs> Just don't, I don't understand. What? What happened there? Why is everything on fire? Was it this? I just did my lava cause this to catch fire? I thought I heard an explosion in fairness, but Okay. <laughs> that is not what I expected. Um <laughs> I'm I'm really stuck now, I'm really stumped as to what just happened. Um, do I want to just convert all of this directly to blaze rods? I think I do, don't I? I really have no idea what just happened. Because even if there was a creeper that was up there and exploded, how did it get up there and why did it explode? It has no reason to explode. You know, I was nowhere near it. So I am totally and utterly stumped as to what just happened. Either way, I've, I've, I need to deal with that mess now. Uh, what goes in this one? Let's stand goes in that one. Blaze goes in that one. Done goes in that one. You get all of that up to 8.6k. Not bad, not bad. There's another another two wall. I'm still in shock 
We're still, what the hell happened here? Let's clear out all this ash. I haven't lost anything. You know, I haven't had any. I'm so confused. I'm so very confused. Uh, palm planks. Let's get the floor rebuilt before someone falls in the lava. And by someone I do of course mean me. I'm wondering if the lava spat up and hit the wood floor. It's the only thing I can think of. And the explosion sounds could Yes, that, okay, there we go. Confirmed. That's what just happened. So um, let me get a bucket. Let's get rid I don't need that passive power gen now. I've got power gen coming from just about anywhere and everywhere else. ash that's everywhere look everything's on fire now so boom you can go away you can be used elsewhere heat gen get lost uh, let's clear out all this ash that's now amassed it also means i don't have to to worry so much about down here now so that's that's pretty cool Gonna make things a little bit nicer down here. Uh, let's clean up all this ash. Let's get these two blocks cleared. Don't know how I managed to miss those earlier. My bad eyes, I guess. Right, there we go. So it was, I'm not sure about, I'm guessing the fire just spread. Um, it does, whilst it does look like an explosion, I'm guessing it's just fire. It just, just came tearing through, didn't it? So I need as many oak wood planks as I can get my hands on for the moment. Actually, to be honest, it doesn't need that many, but... Oi, not really what I was expecting to happen, but it, I should have expected it because I know that wood catches fire from lava because lava spits every now and then, uh, which I, have to, I haven't really heard. It used to make a noise, maybe it doesn't do that anymore. But uh, either way, schoolboy error. Almost there, just need a little bit more. Oak plank. That's right here. This was just very bad planning putting wood above fire or above lava. It was just a bit of a stupid thing to do, I think. And I have now paid the price in the form of having to rebuild. But I think that could come in handy because at some point I do want to build some form of quarry um, for the um, for the other I don't think there's we don't have any build craft in this pack do we FTB industrial contraptions quarry I feel like I need to have a quick look at that and see what that is oh. so that needs a diamond pickaxe an advanced alloy, an advanced circuit, and an advanced machine block. Okay, well, what's what's involved in in some of this stuff? So iron. Okay, some form of. Okay, it's just three three different types of dust. Doesn't seem to matter which. So iron, so iron or lead, 
Constantine and tin or aluminium all of those are no problem but Constantine how do you get Constantine that's copper and nickel so there's a lot of dust needed here um, so let's get some some lead Yeah, there's a lot of everything needed there, wasn't it? So I could do lead, I need copper and nickel. So I need nickel as well. Uh, where's my pulverizer? That's going to be the, the best way at the moment, isn't it? To get dusts. So let's let that do its thing. Now, I have no idea if the. Maybe I should actually look into it. Maybe we should do a quick, um, a quick Google. Of it. Here we go. FTB Industrial Contraptions Quarry. Now this looks at first uh, like it's a little bit, or well, potentially it could be like the old Billcraft Quarry, which I was a fan of. I liked Billcraft. The only thing I didn't like about it was the fact that it never used the same power system as everyone else but to that it doesn't matter so you need to make some landmarks that sounds very build craft place the quarry in front of one of those it only extends the areas forwards uh, Okay, so it looks like it sounds like it could be uh, very much like the old Billcraft quarry. So that's something I do want to make. So let's let's let that start start churning out. Uh, while that's churning out, let's see what else is needed. So the diamond pickaxe, obviously, that's a nice easy one. The advanced circuit needs a whole bunch of stuff I've got. It also needs an electric circuit, which I do not have. So there's a lot more stuff here that I need to 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 make. Uh, industrial grade metal is iron. Ah, is that iron? Oh, just that's just iron in a in a furnace. Oops. I'm just going to make a crap ton of that. I know I'm not going to need it all, but I'm going to do it anyway. Now let's put you over there because I'm going to keep needing you. So industrial grade metal and an LV cable. Ooh, interesting. This needs rubber. So it needs copper ingots, which I've got plenty of, and rubber. And rubber comes from. From cooking slime. Now, what do I have in terms of slime? I've got a fair amount of slime, but can I make slime seeds? So that needs again with the soul jars. Uh, crap ton of slime. So I need 24 slime per jar. I mean, that's not excessive at all, is it? Jeez. So yeah, 20, 24 slime per jar, and I need four jars. So I need 96 slime. And I've got 63. So I can't make slime seeds. But you know what? I've got some seeds, didn't I? Did I happen to just fortune on slime? No, I didn't. Could I make other seeds and hope that I get slime seeds in return? Just to, just to see what happens? Uh, where, where are the slime seeds? They are there, so it's level 2. So if I make other level 2 things, will that give me... 
tier two seed bags. So okay, what can I make out of out of here? And I've already got the coal ones. That's kind of annoying. I'm working on chicken. Actually, my chicken. How's my chicken stuff coming along? Okay, there's a, there's a full jar. Ah, I have all four chicken jars now. So I can make some chicken seeds and then hope that will give me a, a seed bag that contains the, the other seeds. Uh, so I need solium seed base and prudentium essence. What do I feel like I've already got the seeds? Ooh. Uh, did I already do that? No, I didn't. Got most of the things I do need though. Probably going to need some of this stuff. Let's find out what's actually required then. So, chicken seeds. Needs a solium seed, which is a prosperity seed. Do I not have that? No, I don't. No, I do. So, a solium seed base. Check. And prudentium. So, I've already got three, so I actually only need one more of them. That should be everything I need, right? Yeah. Let's go and get that going. So, first up, let's get these going on the outer pedestals. My pain in the ass soul jars on the slightly inner pedestals. And solium seed in the middle. Boom. Chicken seeds. A go-go. Cool. Now that's gone in my backpack because it's bloody annoying. There we go. Now that's in my main hand. It triggers this. So I get a little bit of XP. And let's hope that from this tier 2 seed bag I get slime seeds. I get a night vision augment. Of course I do. What in the hell does that do? I'm guessing it just gives you night vision when you've got it attached to your helmet. Bit of an obvious one, really, wasn't it? Uh, you know what, Blaze? I don't really need you right now. You've you've done a good job. You've given me tons of, of blaze rods. You are not currently needed. So I will swap you out for the chicken seeds, and you can start making some feathers, uh, which I don't necessarily really need right now but it's something I am going to need at some point in the future uh, right so slime or oh, well, some form of rubber I need what are the other options for rubber so it comes from rubber sheets I can cook various different types of slime oh late did I see latex there Okay, latex may be an option. Pink slime is also an option. Um, how do I? How do you make this this latex? So you can put so rubber wood. So you need rubber wood. Okay, that's no good to me. What are my other options? Uh, separating I think pink slime might be believe it or not the only, the only decent option uh, I need buckets, I've never got any bloody buckets before I run outside and do that, let me just check here yeah that's finished Next one on. Uh, 
how's my pink slime doing? 16 buckets there now. And we need glass panes, I think, wasn't it? I happen to have two. Let's just see how how effective this is going to be. Uh, I need the disillusion chamber. I can't just dump that in there like that, can I? Yes, I can. So, is it one bucket? And one glass pane? We'll soon find out. Okay, it's not. It's a slightly odd number. Was that 300? Yeah, 300. That's kind of annoying. <laughs> uh, but, oh well. Doesn't matter. I need more glass then. More glass panes. Let's grab that. And let's also grab... I already have a pink slime um, tank. So if I dump that in there, that in there, can I not? Do they not stack? They don't stack, that's annoying. Um, we need a wrench. And need you to extract. You should start filling up. And now I've got to manually, one by one, put these in, which is going to bore everyone to death. So that's kind of annoying. And then I just cook them, I guess. I don't suppose there's anything, anything better I can do with these. Not really. No, do we have a? I don't actually have a furnace right here. You've totally run out of power. No, oh, it's night time. That'd be why. No sunshine equals no solar equals no power. Mind you doing that, it's not going to help either, is it? But never mind. Uh, this is going to drive me mad. Is there no way I can pipe this in somehow? What about, the, what about a hopper? Can I hopper it in? Enchantment extractor, you need to get out of the way. I dump that there, and you there. Are you gonna, are you gonna be good boy and uh, and just do it all yourself, so I don't have to keep keep annoying you? Yes, good man, good hopper. So I'm probably gonna need a whole bunch more other stuff, but for now, that do. Um, who's outside? Who's who's being annoying? Come, in you come. You just stand in the door, eh? Fine, stay outside then. Battle out here. That took all of two seconds, didn't it? Let's dump all of this stuff away. I'm not even going to put that away because it's just garbage. I uh, don't need to bucket anymore, all the fluid tank, all the glass shards, all the dirt. Oh, the ash. The ash, the ash, the ash. Bad memories. So I've got a little bit of rubber. This is going to take a while. Um... Because you need quite a lot. You need six. Okay, so it's one of those isn't too bad, but still 
frustrating as hell. No, I still don't even have enough. 